The CSS Text Wrapper is an online tool that lets you generate the HTML and CSS to wrap content into any shape. You can make text wrap in and or around curves, slants, zigzags, circles, or really any shape you'd like. The wrap is created by floating divs to the left and right of your content. This technique isn't anything new to the web, but it was always a huge pain because it required tweaking the widths of each and every div pixel by pixel so most often the effect was never really worth the hassle. And that's what this tool is meant to solve. So let's say you've got a totally new suite design, and you've got text that you want to wrap around the very original Web 2.0 logos you made. So to do this, we've got to open up the wrapper. To start in the options, we want to go ahead and enter in the width and the height of the content area. So in our design, the width is 577 pixels by 312 pixels. The height doesn't matter as much, you just need to make sure that the shape that you want will fit inside the boundaries you set here. Then you want to set the approximate line height of the text you're going to be wrapping. You can also set text alignment, font family, and font size. These values won't actually affect your wrap code, but they will help you preview more realistically. We're going to add the URL to the background image of our content area. This will let us just trace to create our wrap. Lastly, if you want, you can add the content you will be wrapping, but it is not necessary as your wrap will stay the same regardless of content. So we're ready to get started tracing. You can manipulate the lines by clicking and dragging on their anchor points like so. To add new points, you just click on the line. Then continue to drag and add points until you have your shape. We can then preview it better by hiding the guidelines. So it looks pretty good. So let's get the code and add it to our site. At the bottom of the page, you'll find that the code has already been generated for you. You have three options as to how to add it to your site. The first method has the pre-generated HTML and CSS. To use this, you simply copy the code from the box and paste it into your website. This method is easy and flexible, but it uses a lot of markup. The second uses classes to shorten the size of the markup considerably, but you'll need a style sheet to copy CSS into as well. The last method is the smallest markup, as it uses JavaScript to generate the code on the fly. The only fallback, of course, is that it needs JavaScript to work. Between these three options, you should be able to find something that works well for your site. We're going to go ahead and use method 1 because it's the easiest one to do. So all we got to do here is just copy the text in the box, And then we're going to add it in just right before the content in our site starts. Let's go ahead and upload this now. So it looks like it fit pretty well. Now if we go back, I can show you here. Now if I start typing here, and as you can see here in Dreamweaver, the text will continue to wrap regardless of the content, which makes it safe to use in content management systems and blogs, as well as a standard website. The CSS Text Wrapper is another idea from the Idea Shower. For more ideas, go to ideashower.com.